Welcome to Daily Worship, Luke 4, 14-21. Then Jesus returned to Galilee, filled with the Holy Spirit's power. Reports about him spread quickly through the whole region. He taught regularly in their synagogues and was praised by everyone. When he came to the village of Nazareth, his boyhood home, he went, as usual, to the synagogue on the Sabbath and stood up to read the scriptures. The scroll of Isaiah the prophet was handed to him. He unrolled the scroll and found the place where this was written. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me, for he has anointed me to bring good news to the poor. He has sent me to proclaim that captives will be released, that the blind will see, that the oppressed will be set free, and that the time of the Lord's favor has come. He rolled up the scroll, handed it back to the attendant, and sat down. All eyes in the synagogue looked at him intently. Then he began to speak to them. The scripture you've just heard has been fulfilled this very day. Acts 10, 43. He is the one all the prophets testified about, saying that everyone who believes in him will have their sins forgiven through his name. Acts 3, 16. Through faith in the name of Jesus, this man was healed, and you know how crippled he was before. Faith in Jesus' name has healed him before your very eyes. 1 Corinthians 15, 57. But thank God, he gives us victory over sin and death through our Lord Jesus Christ. Holy night, when God looked down to see the world in sin and pain is coming. Those he loved had turned away. They were drowning in religion, but barely knew their God. And the Father's heart was moved for them. And God said, It's time. Spirit come, fall on us and change our world with your love. Still our hearts grow tired and cold And the ones we love, they hurt us And we hurt the ones we love And we cry out from our broken lives Will you say, you say Let there be 
Jesus.